Golden Glow was able to be used in roguelike before she officially came out. Wei and Fumizuki were Kuro Blood's OCs before appearing in Arknights. Moose is a very big fan of Emperor, and Magallan is so close to him that other people get jealous. Provence's panties are visible, did you ever notice? The cleaning instructions for Padding's coat are visible and translate to dry cleaning only. In Tomimi's backpack there's a book called Praise the Sun. Tomimi's skin has her signature on it. There was a bug in The Great Chief Gavial Returns rerun where her medal wasn't obtainable. Also, for some reason, she's flying. During her announcement, Schwartz had a crossbow that closely resembled a Barnet crossbow. This was changed later on to a different crossbow. Races like Vulpo and Lupo aren't named in Latin, but in Esperanto. The logistics reserve operator has never appeared in any cutscene. Gladia's name is based on the plural of Gladius, a weapon that she doesn't even use. The enemy with the highest wave is the Salviento Bishop Quintus, with a wave of 99. The heaviest enemy that actually moves is Freya, and a few others, with a wave of 10. Correction of Fact 47 from the first video. Madrock is only immune to pushing during her tower steal animation. The Mainsfield headlights can be given attack using Inspire. In the game files, Beagle also has Gummy's anger effect when attacking, but this is nowhere to be seen in the actual game. It is proven scientifically that humans as a species are hardwired in their DNA to think that Gummy is the best girl in the game. If someone says they don't, they are lying. The Emperor's Blade that spawns in Chapter 8 is a different enemy than the one that spawns in A Walk in the Dust. These ones have 50,000 HP, 0 attack, 3,000 defense, and 90 resistance, which is pretty redundant since they are invincible. Also, the debuff that they give Talula doesn't exist anywhere else in the game. 12F is likely Lowlight's self-insert. The fish from Stultifera Navis is so far the only boss with 4 phases. If you clear Annihilation 9 as perfectly as possible, you will kill around 1000 enemies. Bosses that don't enter the blue box have a time limit. Not killing them in time will result in an instant loss. Gummy's chibi doesn't blink. When Lowlight said, Hey, wouldn't it be funny if we made the best girl in the game, nay, the best girl in all of fiction, some random 4 star in the starter pack? He was actually joking, but Skade took him seriously. If you close the game right after inputting your name during the tutorial and then reopen it, Priestess will break the fourth wall and explain to Amiya that you closed the game. There are no feline vanguards. It is impossible to clear a stage with one star. Zima's name, Sonia, could also be a reference to War and Peace, to a character named... Sonia. Babel is the faction with the least operators. HP loss is not damage. This means it can't be raised or lowered by the player. For example, Madrock at the start of RS3 can't take damage, but still loses HP from Warfare Insights 2. Out of the four robots, Furmex is the only one that explicitly knows he's a robot. In the remastered artbook, we can clearly see Gummy's tail for the first time in official media because you really have to squint to see it on the chibi. W doesn't have the AoE tag. This game uses racism as a gameplay mechanic. 
Myrtle is the most used operator in every single CC so far. Things summoned by operators like Monstre, Phantom's Clone and various summons like Mibos cannot be buffed or debuffed by the Originium Vents. Honeyberry used to not have a tail on her chibi back sprite. This was fixed with guiding ahead. The design for us gen is actually Astasia's alpha design, reused. Istina is still the profile picture for r slash anime memes. Kiera is the only deity who isn't a 6 star operator. And Gummy, her too. Clyde is currently the only enemy who becomes an ally, even if temporarily. Blue Poison and Doberman not only have the same artist, but also the same voice actress. We still don't know who this girl in the loading screen is. Carnelian has a sword, but she never uses it in any of her attacks or animations. The Gavialter event, Ideal City, gives out a staggering 48 originite if fully completed. This video does not have 50 facts.